Welcome to the League of Legends Champion Spotlight, featuring Warwick, the uncaged Wrath of Zaun. Got any bright ideas? Warwick's passive is Eternal Hunger. His basic attacks deal bonus damage. If he's low on health, the bonus damage also heals him. Warwick's Q is Jaws of the Beast. When pressed, he lunges to an enemy, dealing damage based on max health, applying on hit effects, and healing Warwick. If you hold Q down during the lunge, Warwick will actually leap behind the target. As an extra benefit, Warwick will also follow any other movements they make, such as Arcane Shift or Flash. Use Jaws of the Beast and Eternal Hunger whenever possible to stay healthy in the jungle. Just be sure to pick out the splinters after. Warwick's W is Blood Hunt. Whenever Warwick attacks any enemy below half HP, he gains bonus attack speed until he switches targets. Whenever an enemy champion is revealed below half HP anywhere on the map, they are afflicted with Blood Hunt, creating a blood trail that leads toward them. This blood trail will follow Warwick's prey through Fog of War or Stealth. Warwick gains bonus out of combat move speed whenever moving toward a Blood Hunted enemy champion. All of Blood Hunt's passive components are massively increased against enemies who are incredibly low on health. Activating Blood Hunt senses the nearest enemy champion within a large radius, granting the blood trail and speed boosts, regardless of health, for a short time. Blood Hunt's active cooldown is extremely high, but it cools down twice as fast while no enemy champions are hunted. Remember, Blood Hunt's passive applies globally. No enemy is ever out of reach, whether they're fleeing from a Yordle with a big ol' hammer or simply cowering under a turret. Warwick's E is Primal Howl. When activated, Warwick takes significantly reduced damage for a short period of time. When the effect wears off, or if deactivated early, Warwick causes nearby enemies to flee from him. Even a wolfman can find chickens daunting, but thanks to Primal Howl's damage reduction, Warwick can raid the coop without taking a pecking. Warwick's ultimate is Infinite Direct. He leaps in a target direction, suppressing the first enemy champion he collides with, damages them, repeatedly applies on hit effects, and then heals himself for all the damage he dealt them. Infinite Duress's leap distance increases with Warwick's movement speed. He's immune to crowd control during the leap, but not during suppression. If Primal Howl is active when you tackle an enemy champion with Infinite Duress, it will immediately deactivate to send surrounding foes fleeing. If the uncaged Wrath of Zaun stacks enough movement speed, Infinite Duress's leap distance gets downright loony. Use it to get in the enemy backline space, then jam on him. Jaws of the Beast's leap is perfect for sinking your teeth into elusive prey. Here, Warwick picks up a Mumu scent and closes the initial gap with Blood Hunt's movement speed. Primal Howl makes the sad mummy cry in fear, slowing him down. Warwick then saves Jaws of the Beast to follow in case of a bandage toss or flash, killing him at the end. Blood Hunt's active ensures every chase is a thriller, even against a healthy target. Here, Warwick injects himself with singed, patented Hooch Hooch, and pops Ghost to get within range. He cuts off Twitch's escape path with Jaws of the Beast before turning the rat into his new favorite chew toy. Unchecked Bloodlust can land you in some hairy situations, 
Here, Warwick hunts down Ziggs and attempts to rip him apart with infinite duress. However, he misses. Additionally, he has no idea Graves was swinging by for defense, as he's healthy and not hunted. Unlucky. Warwick's howl is enough to split even the tightest wolf packs. He preps Primal Howl, then begins the attack on Titan of the Depths using Jaws of the Beast. Primal Howl's fear turns Nautilus into the team's loneliest tank, before Warwick's team finally picks up the kill. Any minute now. You can pull off a similar trick with infinite duress. Here, Warwick spots some approaching squishies and preps Primal Howl. He chooses Zareth as his target, terrifying the sparkly blue man's allies. From there, Warwick can sniff out fleeing prey and pick up tomorrow's dinner. <laughs> Thanks for watching the Warwick Champion Spotlight. Check out more of the Uncaged Wrath of Zon using the links below. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.